expressing finished single actions versus expressing unfinished single actions. Compare the following two sentences. I have already done my homework and I have been doing my homework all morning. The present perfect is used to express finished single actions. For example, I have already done my homework. In this example, I started to do my homework at an indefinite time in the past and I have completed or finished doing it before now. The action is completed or finished. On the other hand, the present perfect continuous is used to express unfinished single actions. For example, I have been doing my homework all morning. In this example, I started to do homework at the beginning of the morning and I have spent all morning doing my homework. Doing homework has been in progress or continuing all morning up to the time of speaking. The action is unfinished. It is not completed. Now, we can summarize what we have just studied in this video in the following grammatical rule. The present perfect is used to express the completion of the action before now or before the time of speaking. The action is finished or completed. Some words are used to emphasize this meaning like just to mean that the action has immediately happened or completed. Already to mean that the action has happened or completed before now. And yet to mean that the action hasn't happened or completed till now. Or to ask about the completion of the action. On the other hand, the present perfect continuous is used to express the continuity of the action for a period of time and that the action has been in progress or continuing from the past up to now or up to the time of speaking. The action is not completed at the time of speaking. The action is unfinished. Some words are used to emphasize this meaning like all morning, all day, all week, etc. Since, for, and how long.